obviously Anna. So one of the biggest things, the biggest challenges that I found that most of my clients struggle with is confidence, really believing that they can do something. So I've come up with three simple steps and tips to give you to help you, um, you know, move through any confidence barriers, barriers that you might be experiencing yourself. So in this video, I'm going to share one of the, the tips with you. One of the easiest ways to boost your confidence is by using EFT. My most favorite thing to do is to tap. Um, for those of you who haven't watched my previous videos, EFT stands for Emotional Freedom Techniques. It's also called tapping. It comes from acupuncture. I'm not going to go into a huge explanation right now. You can go to my website if you want more information. But basically, what it involves is lightly tapping the meridian points or the acupuncture points while you're talking about something you're stressed about. So if you're struggling with confidence, um, one of the big things is, I'm not good enough to do this. Nobody will accept me. Um, nobody's going to give me a chance. So pick whatever you know statement or phrase you like to meet yourself up with, and then just tap along. I'm going to do something really short just to kind of give you an example. All right, so take a deep breath. And find a collarbone and drop down just a little bit and feel around for any sore or tender spots. Once you find one, just camp out there and give it a little circular massage. Take one more deep breath. <sighs> Typically, I'll have you start with a setup statement, which begins with, even though I have this issue, and it ends with some form of love or acceptance. So, let's go ahead and start. You repeat after me. And again, you can use your own words. Even though I struggle with confidence, I choose to love and honor myself. Even though I often believe that I'm not good enough, I choose to love myself anyway. Even though at times it's really hard for me to believe in myself. I choose to deeply and completely love myself, forgive myself, and I honor where I am. We're going up to the eyebrow point, right here at the beginning of the eyebrow. This lack of confidence, side of the eye, this lack of confidence under the eye. I just don't believe in myself. Under the nose, it's hard for me to think I'm good enough. Chin, or that I even deserve any of this. Chest. This lack of confidence. Top of the head, this lack of confidence. Eyebrow, it's hard for me to believe in myself. Side of the eye, I don't know how to get through this. Under the eye, I'm not even sure if I want to. Under the nose, this lack of confidence. Chin, this lack of of confidence. Chest. I just don't know if I can get through this. And good stop. Usually I'll do two rounds of what we call negative and I'll just talk out however I'm feeling. Um, I'll say it exactly the way I'm hearing it in my head and I'll just voice that. And then I'll do two rounds where I'm doing all the points of positive. What if I can believe in myself? What if it's safe to have confidence? Something more positive along those lines. All right, well, that is your first tip in, um, in the series. Thank you so much for watching, and stay tuned for video number two.